I am psyched to be here. Welcome to Brain Surge, the show where all you need is a great memory and super concentration skills. You're gonna do just fine. Let's meet today's Brainiac. Jordan's fastball has been clocked at 67 miles an hour. My car doesn't even go that fast. Christian wants to play for the Pittsburgh Steelers like his uncle. Will he put anything on the scoreboard today? Tiana starts to hiccup if she laughs too much. I think the brain drain may be the cure. Natalie is a national dance champion. Will she two steps to victory today? Marco loves to pull pranks on his friends. Careful, buddy, I got a few tricks up my sleeve. And Haley claims to have a photographic memory. Well, she's on the right show for that. One of you guys today, and I'm looking in your direction over here, is gonna go home a brain surge champion. With that title is gonna come a chance at thousands of dollars in prizes, plus a sliming from head to toe. However, the rest of you, there's only one way out of here. And that is down the brain drain. I'm gonna go head over to the brain star so we can get started. Level one. I'm ready to kick this thing off with a 10 point puzzle. I hope you are ready. Pay attention to these instructions. I'm about to throw a baseball which has a number on it. You'll see the ball several times, so enter the number as soon as you can identify it. Jordan, do you know how fast that fastball was? Pretty fast. Take a guess. 75? 76. Close. That's right. Let's see what the correct answer is. It was eight, two, nine. All right, let's see who got it right. Everybody got it right. That's 10 points across the board. This next puzzle right here is worth 20 points. You guys ready for that? Yeah. yeah. Here it comes. I'm about to drop some paint balloons on some people's heads. Keep track of how many different colors of balloons I drop. Hey! How many different colors of balloons did I drop? All right, let's see what the correct answer is. Five is the correct answer. Let's see who got it right. Christian, Natalie, Jordan, and Martha, congratulations at 20 points to your score. Speaking of points, I got 30 of them. You can get them by watching this puzzle. I'm gonna buy a dozen gumballs from this gumball machine. Pay attention to the numbers on the first six gumballs. Now, I'm gonna buy another six gumballs. Which of these numbers did not appear in the first group? How are we feeling about that one? Good. 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 Let's see what the correct answer is. Here's what I'm talking about with the bubbles. See? Boom. Seven was the correct answer. Let's see who got it right. Christian, Jordan, Tiana, and Marco, congratulations. Give yourself 30 points. All right, here's the next puzzle, and it's worth 40 points. Roll it. Check out these four phones. Pay attention to which phone has which ringtone. Now, check out this ringtone. Which phone does it belong to? Oh, I'm sorry. I just love that song. It's fantastic. All right. Let's see what the correct answer is. Yeah, I see a lot of people clapping. 
Let's see who put in three. <laughs> Jordan, Christian, Nally, Haley, and Marco, congratulations. You just got yourself 40 points. Tiana, you didn't get your answer in on time. But shake it off. Shake yeah. it off. Shake it off. There it is. That's yeah. what I like to see. This puzzle right here is worth 50 points. Take a look at this. This kid's about to ride a crazy roller coaster. See if you can count how many loops it does. How many loops did it do? Tiana, what's better, a roller coaster or a really fast Ferris wheel ride? I'd say a roller coaster. Roller coaster? Anyone gonna go with the Ferris wheel? Show of hands. <laughs> Keeping in mind that the Ferris wheel is really fast. Does that change anyone's mind? Okay, nice. Haley's on board. Fantastic. Let's see what the correct answer is. That sound means it's a replay. Six, and just for a good show of measure, we're gonna barf all over the screen with six. Let's see who got it right. Everybody's getting 50 points. That's what I like to see. Let's take a look at the scores. Jordan, Christian, Marco, you each have 150 points and are tied for first. Very nice. Natalie, you got yourself 120 points. Haley, 100. And Tiana, 90. It is a close game. This puzzle is worth 100 points. Pay attention. I tried to sleep last night, but there was something keeping me awake. What? There's monsters under my bed? Keep track of each pair of eyes and count how many monsters there were. How many monsters were underneath my bed? Let's see what the correct answer is. <laughs> 100 points is going to anyone who answered nine. Let's see who did. Haley and Marco, congratulations. You just got yourself 100 points. Now it's time to find out which four of you are moving on to level two and which two are going down the brain drain. In first place, getting every single puzzle correct with 250 points is Marco. Congratulations. In second place with 200 points is Haley. We have a tie for the remaining two spots, but the four players left. The two players that are moving on with 150 points each is Jordan and Christian. Congratulations, you're moving on to the next level. Natalie, Tiana, you guys played a great game. And before we send you down the brain drain, let's find out what you've won. Congratulations, you've won a SpongeBob Wii game. SpongeBob SquarePants featuring Nicktoons Globs of Doom with 10 playable Nickelodeon characters. Play as both heroes and villains while defeating the Morphoids. All that and a bucket of slime. There's only one way out of here, and it is down the brain drain. Tiana, Natalie, are you guys ready? Yeah! Come on down, Tiana! See you later, Tiana! Natalie, come on down! Thanks for playing! When we come back, these four Brainiacs are going to put their massive minds to the test on level two. Don't go anywhere! Welcome back to Brain Surge. Congratulations to these four Brainiacs for making it to level two. How about it? How about it? Let's get to know you guys better with these blue cards. Marco, you're a prankster. What's the best prank you've ever pulled? Well, when I was in junior high school, me and my friend Victor walked into the bathroom. We see my friend Morgan coming out, so we grab him. I grab him by the legs. My friend Victor sticks his head in the toilet, flushes it. And when he comes out, his head's dripping wet. We run off laughing. He comes to us mad. Yes. Hey, you know what? That's a good one. We call that one the swirly, right? Very nice. Haley, 
You randomly break into song? I do. When um, I tried out for this with my friend, we were both, like, kind of nervous. I started singing a song, I don't remember what it was, but they just, like, I don't know, it calmed us all down. Is that why you were singing earlier? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very good. Jordan, you got yourself a pretty fast fastball, huh? Yeah. 67 miles an hour? Yeah. So you going pro? Hopefully. Have you thrown a no-hitter yet? No. No? Maybe tomorrow? Maybe. All right. Maybe. I'm keeping my eye on you. All right, Christian. Yeah. I hear you can do the moonwalk. Yeah, and when okay. you make a bold claim like that, you know I have to see it. All right. How about it? All right. Here it comes. Clear okay. the ways. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Awesome job, dude. Nice. Woo! Enough chit chat. What do you say we play this game? Let's do it. Level two. All right, guys, on this level, I'm going to tell you a story from my big book of truth. You know it, you love it, it's fantastic. On your feet, it's story time. Oh, this is a good one. Remember, everything I tell you is absolutely 100% true. Are we clear? Yeah. All right. They say it's the thought that counts. But when it comes to birthday gifts, my family should keep their thoughts to themselves. Here are some gifts I've received over the years. A cockroach farm. I guess they moved out of the motel and bought the farm. A box of crayons that had been broken and stapled back together. An oven mitt with no thumb. I smell the nine cent store. A jar of farts. I'm never pulling my uncle's finger again. A boomerang, and no matter how many times I try, I just cannot get rid of it. A miniature sailboat, and this is gonna go perfect with my miniature harbor. My cousin's old cheerleader uniform, and she's not even my size. And bless her heart, my grandma, the most clueless of all when it comes to birthday gifts. She gave me a personalized teddy bear. She's been giving me this since I was five. A 2003 groundhog calendar, and groundhogs freak me out. A sweater knit from my grandma's fold sweaters, and it smells like mothballs and bingo. Then there are those gifts that you just know were on sale, like a nose warmer, and this is great until you get a runny nose. A soup spinner, it's like the salad spinner, only a lot messier. An earwax cleaner, I still have water in my ear from that one. And a beef jerky wallet, and if it ever wears out, I can always eat it. But this year, my family finally gave me something really cool. My very own singing shark. And it doesn't get any better than that. That's my story, guys, and it's all true. One at a time, I want you guys to just name off a birthday gift I received. To lock in your answer, you're going to sit down. If you hear this, that means you're right. And if you hear this, Haley, have a seat and demonstrate for us. Oh, you are wrong, and you're going to hang on for the ride. All right? Marco, let's start with you. What was one of the birthday gifts I received? A groundhog calendar. Groundhog calendar. Very good. <laughs> Haley, how about it? Um, a boomerang. A boomerang. Have a seat. Jordan. A personalized teddy bear. Personalized teddy bear. Very good. Christian. Um, an oven mitt with the thumb tore out. OK. Have a seat. Marco. Uh, ear washer. Ear washer? A high-powered ear washer, nonetheless. Haley. Um, a... Crayons. Crayons. All right, have a seat. You got it. Jordan. A jar of farts. A jar of farts. <laughs> You gotta cap that back up to keep all the smell. Uh, a singing shark. A singing shark. Sweet. Marco. Uh, a sweater knit out of other sweaters from your grandma. Oh, those are details right there, Haley. Um. Uh, uh, oh, time's running out. Gonna need an answer. I don't know. I didn't even say anything. No. Oh, time's up. Have a seat, Haley. Oh. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Jordan. Oh. Uh-oh. I need an answer real quick. Just throw something uh. out. Oh, Jordan, have a seat and hang on. 
See you later. Marco, Christian, guess what? What? It's time for a knockout round. Knockout round. We're gonna pump it up a notch right here. Behind those numbers are pairs of images from the story you just heard. Match a pair correctly, you're staying in the game. I'm gonna give you 10 seconds to memorize the board, and here it comes. Ten seconds is up. How was it? Good? You guys got a good look? Yeah. All right, Marco, what's your first number? First number is one. One. And? And ten. And ten. Good. We want that one to stay up on the board as much as possible. Christian, um, what's your first number? Twelve. Twelve. And six. And six. Looks like you got yourself a match. Marco, back to you. Two. Two. And fourteen. And fourteen? Oh, okay. That was incorrect match, which means we're in sudden death territory. The next correct match is going to be the Brain Search champion for today and move on to the final round. What is um, your first number? Pick wisely. 14. 14. And three. And three. For the win. He's got it. Awesome game, but you know it has to happen. Have a seat and hold on. Oh! Christian, you're moving on to the final round. Put it right there, my friend. You're going to play for thousands of dollars in prizes, plus a sliming you're never going to forget. Let's see what Haley, Jordan, and Marco won for making it this far. Congratulations! You've won a pair of rollerblade inline skates. Genuine rollerblade brand gives you a comfortable fit with a graduated heel brake for controlled skating. These skates adjust up to four sizes so it grows as you grow. Rollerblade, the original inline skate. There's only one way out of here, and it is down the brain drain. Haley, Marco, Jordan, are you guys ready? Come on down, Haley. See you later. Christian can find the path to victory on level three, the final stage. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Welcome back to Brain Surge. I'm Jeff. And this guy right here is Christian. All right, you feeling good about this here? Yeah, I'm feeling real good. All right, because you're about to enter the final stage where you could win thousands of dollars in prizes, plus a sliming you're never going to forget. Level three, the final stage. All right, Christian, this level's got three parts. Each one's more difficult than the last. It's your job to memorize the light pattern that appears on the floor and then recreate it by stepping on the right squares. For example, this is right and this is wrong. When that happens, you're going to come back here and you're going to start all over. Once you complete the first path, you're going to want to stop the clock by stepping on that button right up there. Okay. Once you do that, you're going to get yourself a prize. Plus, the floor is going to open up to the 5x5 five five grid and the second path will be revealed. Complete that path and then you're going to be faced with the hardest path of them all, the 6x6 six six grid. It is awesome. It is magnificent. It is hard. Here's what you could win. Complete the 4x4 four four and win a karaoke system. Karaoke from Boca Pro, the portable karaoke system that includes pre-installed songs and memory cards. All you need is a TV and Boca Pro's karaoke system. Complete the 5x5 five five and win a portable keyboard. The PSR E413 Yamaha portable keyboard has new auto styles and ProSense features. Make your own music and produce your own songs with Yamaha's PSR E413 portable keyboard. Complete the 6x6 and go to Magic Mountain! Stay at the Hilton Garden in Valencia Six Flags with an outdoor pool and spa. Plus all the rides and attractions at Six Flags Magic Mountain. All right, Christian, this is it, and I seem to have left my 90 seconds at home. You got an extra on you? Yeah. There it is. Okay, put it up on the board. <laughs> nice style. Okay, here's your first path. Okay. Pay attention. You are going to see it twice. The clock's gonna start when you make your first step. Good luck. He's off. Stop the clock. Hey, guess who got a karaoke machine? 
this guy right here and take a look. It's the five by five as promised. Here's your path, take a look. Here it comes one more time. You've got 84 seconds left and it starts when you make your first step, good luck. Oh yeah, oh yeah, he is so confident. Take a look, here it is. All right, he's, he shook his head. He knows where he went wrong. Yeah! Woo! That's what I'm going to love, Christian. You just got yourself a keyboard, and you have 65 seconds left to conquer the six by six. This is for all the marbles. This is for the trip to six flags. This is for the sliming. It's gonna be awesome! Here it is! <laughs> All right, one more time. Here it comes. All right, go ahead. He's off. He's off and running. Hurry back, hurry back. All right, take another look. All right, here he goes. Clock is still running. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Hurry back, hurry back, hurry back. All right, still have plenty of time. You got yourself about 40 seconds left. Oh, oh. He's looking real strong, zigzagging all over the place. Oh, Christian, you are a winner!